Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol OBCI. We will take a look at the 30-minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30-minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link. So if you go there, I'll explain in detail. Quite the eventful day on this one today, not only from the price action point of view, but you look down here at the volume and well above average volume on the day. Unfortunately, it was a, a, a very rough day, and in you know trading terminology, the easiest way to summarize today's price movement was just a gap and trap. What do I mean by gap and trap? Well, on Monday, the price closed down here. And then all of a sudden the price opened up right there. Price made its way upwards. And then from that point, just all bears the remainder of the day and back down the price went to almost where it all started. And this is why I'm not gonna call it a pump and dump uh, because the price does still technically speaking to be fair from a big picture point of view, have the opportunity to show some signs of progress by staying up above $3.70. Now, if the price comes back down here to 370 then falls down through it. Well, at that point, from a very literal perspective, you would very literally have the price right back to where it was before the big move happened. And not to insult your intelligence, but price movements that go back to where they were, not exactly a sign of true strength. And at that point, that would imply that the price made a great move up. And then all of a sudden, right went right back to where it was. And that is, by definition, a pump and dump right there. Uh, but like I said, it was a gap and trap, no doubt about it. Uh, but now it's really just a question of is this gap and trap going to turn into a pump and dump? And once again, that's where 370 comes into play. Now, in the event, this is the bottom and the, the price starts to work its way back upwards. Let's talk about a couple areas of resistance. Initial area of resistance and any sort of attempted bounce upwards is going to be right there at $4.35. And then a 435 can be broken. Next key area after that, right up there around 475. So, 435, 475, next couple of key levels from the resistance side of things. But yeah, things are definitely looking very, very shaky right now. So let's see if the price can hold up above 370 or not. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too, good, way too good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.